Tonight's dinner is baked salmon, steamed broccoli, roasted julienne root vegetables. It's beets, carrots, parsnips, and sweet potato. And it's seasoned with, I believe it's like pepper and paprika and a few other things. This is a Trader Joe's uh, mix. And the consensus with the kids is that they really like the parsnips and the carrots, uh, the sweet potatoes, one likes the others, meh, and my son will tolerate the beets, but my daughter hates them, and I don't know if I will like them or not, but we'll see. And then blackberries and strawberries. So I'm going to try one of the beets. They're a little sweet for me, actually. I've never been a big fan of beets. So I think I'll try making them from scratch after I use up the other bag and see, um, well, just the parsnips and the carrots and the sweet potatoes without the beets in them. All right, and that is dinner for tonight. Tonight's dinner is baked potatoes, lamb, broccoli, and a salad, and the lettuce is from the garden. Tonight's dinner is beef carnitas and spelt tortilla and oranges. Hey, I didn't have any oven bags, so I was not able to cook the turkey today. And I'm not feeling great still. I haven't quite gotten rid of this cold yet. So I just went and gave in and got pizza. And uh, I'll add a salad, but it won't make up for this. Tonight's dinner is turkey, mashed potatoes and gravy, and broccoli. Tonight's dinner is leftover turkey and tater tot casserole, an orange, and broccoli. Come and get it asked what I eat for breakfast and lunches. So um, I'm going to do a little video with those things in it. It might get pretty repetitive. We'll see. I might try to have a little more variety this week than normal. But anyway, so today for breakfast I'm having leftover chicken and broccoli. Actually, this is more of a brunch today because I probably won't eat actual lunch. Uh, this is a typical lunch, and this is on a day when I didn't actually eat breakfast. I don't have my full appetite back yet, and um, haven't really been hungry at all in the mornings, but by the time I get to lunch, I'm pretty hungry. So, a couple of chicken legs that um, are oven-baked, and some leftover zucchini and summer squash. This is pretty typical. I'll have a protein and um, some kind of low-carb veggie, usually for lunch, and this Breakfast is generally the same as well. Um, I tend to keep my carbs to dinner, so or my higher carbs to dinner. Um, I function better throughout the day if I do that. This is another typical lunch for me. I have roast chicken slice with bell peppers and mustard inside, and then two sun-dried tomato turkey slices with peppers and mustard inside and then two roast beef slices with peppers and mustard inside. So that's pretty standard for what I eat. Um, the kids generally eat fettuccine alfredo or sandwiches and my husband eats at work. This is a typical breakfast uh, around here. It's eggs scrambled with turkey ham, red and green bell peppers, onion, pico de gallo. Um, mostly I just take the tomatoes from the pico de gallo because I really don't want to have the jalapenos in uh, my breakfast. I don't want to have heartburn all day so um, and some kind of cheese. I like to use uh, 
either Parmesan or Romano actually because then I don't need to add salt to this and then pepper of course so fairly typical um, if my husband is eating it there's usually hash brown shreds or leftover diced up potato thrown in here and um, toast as well All right, today's lunch is just a chicken leg and some cucumber slices. Uh, I had a big breakfast this morning, so don't need a big lunch. All right, this is breakfast for today. I have about a half of a ribeye steak and some daikon radish hash browns. And here's my meal plan for the week. On Wednesday, I'm going to have chicken stir fry with broccoli, cauliflower, carrots, onions, snow peas, water chestnuts, and then canned pineapple to go with. On Thursday, leftover turkey, mashed potatoes, canned pears, and salad. On Friday, herb roasted rabbit, baked potatoes, green beans, and oranges. On Saturday, honey apricot chicken, mashed celeriac, broccoli, and canned pineapple. On Sunday, beef stir fry with onions and peppers, kind of a black pepper steak sort of thing. A salad and oranges. On Monday, codfish, parsnip fries, coleslaw, and canned pears. And on Tuesday, Filipino chicken adobo with potatoes and carrots, broccoli, and oranges. If I find any good berries on sale this week, I will add berries into the food log instead of some of these other fruits. We'll see. Alright, that is the meal planning for week 18.